Hello, this is Chris Jackson from ActionQA.com. Today, just have a quick tutorial on how to set XPath as the default for all your Nightwatch tests. And here we go. Okay, so if you don't want to use this browser.use XPath, you just want to have XPath be your default selector, there's a way to set that up using the nightwatch.conf.js, the config file. And I'm going to switch over here just to show you how you can find this on the Nightwatch page. Under getting started, there's a lot of configurations here under this configuration directory. So if we go down here, there's a ton of stuff, but what you want is not the base settings, scroll down, test session settings right here. And under here, you'll see something called use xpath by default that's set to false but if you set it to true everything will use xpath instead of css let's go back to our config file let's go down here to the test settings under the default environment this is this the default settings that all the tests use we can just add use underscore xpath on true. Save that. Go over to our test. Let's get rid of this uh, second test right here. We don't want it. Get out of here. And then, since we set XPath as the default, then we can just get rid of that. And our XPath selector right here should just work out of the box without us doing anything. Let's go over here to the command line. Let's run the test. Whoa, there you go. And that's how you set globally Nightwatch back to uh, to use XPath selectors. And I'm going to set this for false for the rest of our tests. Because uh, I'm just used to using the CSS selectors. It's easier with Nightwatch because everything including the page objects, which we'll cover in a later tutorial. Out of the box, also use CSS selectors. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And uh, I think all this will be coming out on Udemy pretty soon. Udemy? Udemy? Pretty soon as an introductory course. So keep an eye out for that. All right. Please, if you have any questions at all, please uh, leave something in the comments. I'd love to talk to you. All right. Bye. Wear your mask.